In this episode of Valve House, we're going to be showing you how to paint your rocker cover. Righto, so while we're waiting for the oil to drain, we're just getting ready to take the tapper cover off. Just taking off all these 10 mils here, and then it should be ready for paint. Alright, so we popped all the bolts and washers off, so she's ready to come off. There we go. Take it outside. Right, so we've pulled the rocket cover off. Now, our only worry is there's a bit of this gasket glue around the edges, so we don't know if they were just trying to get more life out of the um, uh, tapper cover gasket or what, but we're just gonna pull it off, get it ready for paint, and we should be pretty sweet. Alright, I'm just gonna gurney all this oil off first. Right, so we're gonna pressure wash this to see how much of the black we can get off. Alright, so we just finished gurning it off. As you can see, we got a fair bit of paint off just with gurning it. So now for the remainder, we're just going to hit it with some paint stripper. And hopefully that should get it all off and then scrub with a wire brush and it should be back to bare metal. As you can see, it's all shiny, back to bare metal. Uh, we used quite a bit of paint stripper on it, more than we intended to, but we used a lot of paint stripper, got it down to this stage, then we just finished off with some wet and dry, just to get it nice and smooth, ready for the paint. All right, so we just finished masking it up. As you can see, all the holes and plugs are all taped off. Nothing's gonna get in there. And now we're just ready to give it a coat now. Start off light. Coat two. All right, so as you can see, we've left it overnight and it's dried. So we're gonna peel all the masking tape off now and uh, raise the blade back the Honda Motorco letters. So it's all nice and shiny. So the tapper cover is all done now. So we just use a razor and a bit of turps to clean up the Honda Co there. And yeah, it's good to put on the engine. So the rocket cover's back on now, we've attached all the hardware, it's all good to go. Stripping it down was a much bigger process than we originally thought because it took way more coats of paint strippers, but it's on there now and it looks great. Definitely worth the result, I'm super happy with how it come out. Now that, now that I've seen the result, I'm going to do it on the EP3 because I'm so happy with how it looks. It, for the money and what it looks like now, I'm just really happy with how it turned out. Thanks for watching this episode of Valve House.